Let's take a look at how the Asian markets are doing this morning. Almost all Asian markets are in green in these early trading hours. That's mostly due to US President Joe Biden and Speaker of House Kevin McCarthy hinting at reaching a consensus on the debt ceiling standoff. Japan is leading gains in Asia this after Japan's trade deficit narrowed by almost half in April. Wall Street ended with stellar gains as well with the tech heavy Nasdaq leading the gains. Overall investor sentiment is bright cryptos have rebounded overnight with major coins gaining up to 2%. Bitcoin is back above $27,000 while Ethereum is close to $1900. Other cryptos making big moves are Litecoin and Ripple, which are up 4%. On to the commodities market now. Brent crude is back over $75 per barrel, while the US crude is above $72 per barrel. Brent is gaining as the dollar strengthens against a basket of other currencies. Remember, when the dollar gains, crude becomes more expensive for importers. A stronger dollar also weighs on precious metals, gold, silver and platinum, as well as palladium, all down. Gold is still close to $2,000 per ounce, but analysts predict gold could rally if the two American parties fail to end their deadlock on the U.S. debt ceiling. Beyond is now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the news on the move.